hi guys, we're taking part in a blog tour for this book, Kid Crazy and the Kilowatt King. Now this book is written by Claudio Sanchez, who is the front man for Coheed and Cambria. He's already a New York Times best-selling comic book creator, but he ventured into new territory with his first children's book, the one we see here, Kid Crazy and the Kilowatt King. In this book, Kid Crazy Carlson longs for adventure in the far-off and bustling city of Ever. His world changes when he meets a strange droid named Denuzio. This droid warns Kid of the city's grumpy Kilowatt King, who's a rude man, and one that forces the citizens to sing for him. Despite the robot's warning, Kid decides to make the voyage to the city and the two set sail in a car made of bread through beautiful and bizarre landscapes, passing extraordinary sights like candy bar men, robot travelers, and dancing elephants, before finally reaching the city. When Kid eventually comes face to face with the rotten ruler, he decides it's time someone teaches him a lesson in manners and the power of the word please. The idea for Kid Crazy actually started as a rock opera in the vein of Siggy Stardust and the Spiders from, from Mars, says Sanchez, but as it took shape, it began to feel like something that could appeal to a child's imagination. Kind of fantastic journey with a lesson. The 80-page book features art from Brazilian illustrator Arthur Mask. Several exclusive book bundles are available on Sanchez's own Evil Link Comics website, evilink.com including a Kid Crazy limited Coke bottle green 7-inch vinyl featuring an original song and the Kid Crazy and the Kilowatt King audiobook read by Claudio Sanchez. The book is 9 by 8 in size, 9 inches by 8 inches in size, retails for 24.95 US dollars. The book is by One Piece Books, and it's a large book. There are not too many words on the pages, so you don't you know, think you're going to be reading if you're reading this to your child for like an hour and a half, um, you know, when you want them to go to bed. But you'll see the, the illustrations, and I read this to my kids the other night, and they really like this. So, you know, I can show you here. There's a dedication to Atlas. If you ever feel the world is on your shoulders, remember it's actually in the palm of your hand, Mom and Dad. And so that's, just make sure you can see, you can see the main character there. There's a kid. This is the story of a boy lost at sea, but the sea was a desert and he longed to be free. So it's a, it's a very nice, um, book to read at night because it has a very good message and like I said it's enjoyable very nice illustrations kids and adults will like it how I long to explore in the walls of that place sighed the curious boy a sad look on his face sounds like it can be read like the night before Christmas almost <laughs> then came an answer through the quiet and bare from a droid who before simply had not been there or sometimes it sounds a little bit like Dr. Seuss, but it's... I can't understand why you'd want such a thing. Why go to that city with its rude, sour king? There, there's the, you know, it's sounding like Dr. Seuss to me, but... It's, it's a delightful book, so if you want to check it out, you know, you can, we're going to add it to the holiday gift guide as well. Make some lovely present for um, any child. It's Kid Crazy and the Kilowatt King by Claudio Sanchez and illustrated by Arthur Mask. Thanks for watching.